Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be me playing with stuff I have not played with. This. <laughs> I was so excited to get this. This is from Annette. Um, she had done a collab with Odin's Eye, and I have not played with it. And this one, I don't remember where I got this. I have not tried Alf's bronzers. And of course, the apple from Kat Von D. So, let's start with my eyes. Let's see how these perform. And I've heard mixed reviews on the foundation. So, hopefully, it is good. So, I'm going to start. Let's start with priming my eyes. Just gonna take my Anastasia and oh, just put a little bit. It does come with a little mirror. And let's start with this brush right here. It is, I don't know, I can't see. Okay, um, let's start with a blaze right here. And we're just gonna take that on just right above. Above. I'm just going in the windshield wiper motions and then I will start with the circular. But as of right now, I'm just going to pull it right where it ends. I want to kind of pull this down too. Just, I'm being really messy about it because I'll clean that up afterwards. Right now I have no other product and I'm just going to go same thing but off with circular motions. And I don't set my base. I learned that from Pinky Sweets. Just to get more of the color payoff, I'm just going in circular motions just to kind of smooth out the edge. I'm going to take this brush right here. It is, I, I don't know, going into going into howling right here just gonna tap that to the outer and just sticking to my V but then again I am being really uh, messy I'm not really concerned about my placement I am just patting it on right now I'm just getting the tip and just pulling down and I'm going a little above my crease, same thing, I'm pulling down. My dogs weren't barking, they were so quiet. Then I start filming, boom, there you go. They're like, mom is filming, gonna make some noise. So I'm gonna go in with Haughty or Haiti. I'm gonna take it on this brush right here. I do love the way that this blush applies. I was not picking up the way I really want it to. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try a crease brush. Now let's see if this one applies it a little bit better. Much better. Okay. Kind of just, you have to spray it. Just kind of looks like a top coat. Let's go in with this one. Let's try this Alamar. And let's see if it, if not, I'm going to try to spray it. Okay, Alamar is bringing, packing it way better. But I'm also going to spray. I just didn't feel like doing a regular cut crease. So I'm doing a lazy girl. Okay. Let's try to spray this. Let's see. That works a little bit better. I'm gonna take my Mario Badescu and just spray my brush. Right in, once again. Here, I'm gonna go back into um, Howling right here and just kind of. No, no, no. Let's go into Skull right here. Same brush. 
just going to put that right. Okay. Let's clean this up. Let me clean this up and I'll be right back. Okay, so I already primed my face. I primed it without being on camera because I've already used it. So I used the milk and then my tart. Did not mean to do that. So I'm going to apply half with the Kat Von D brush and half with my damp sponge. I got medium 030. Don't know if this is going to be my color shade. At Ulta, there wasn't that many, so this, I tried to really kind of match, but we will, we will see. Because sometimes I get totally the wrong shade. So, I'm going to start with the brush first and just bring this in. I really like this brush. You are able to get, okay, I just need a tiny bit more. I like the way that this brush applied it. Actually, that's a really good color shade for me. So, without, let's try the beauty blender. So, my beauty blender is already damp. I'm just going to kind of With the sponge, it got way better, way better coverage. So I'm just going to go over the brush, the brush side. Oh yeah, with the, the sponge it got. This looks a little bit more natural. Okay. Maybe like a light medium. Full. Totally full. I like both. Let's see how it. I'm going to bring it down. I'm going to go over this with my damp sponge just to kind of. Wow. I really like this. Let's see how it wears though. And it got my nose pretty good. Usually I, I have um, issues with my nose. I like this brush, but I also like, I like both. Wow. And it's actually a good shade. I didn't think it was going to be. We are going to take, I've used this multiple times. I've used a lot, so. I used it a lot, but I want it to glow. It's kind of waiting. Going back in to Odin's eye, I'm gonna take this. It's like a little uh, brow. No, 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 no. Let's do this orange one. Let's go in with a. Let's go in with Cosmo. A lot of the shades. Patting that to where. I'm gonna clean this off. I'm gonna go into a blaze right here, right on my waterline. With this brush right here, it's just a tiny little brush. I'm going to take, let's take Eternal right here. And let's see how that's bringing it down. Just to kind of make sure it meshes. Bringing it just a little up just to kind of make it look seamless. My eye has like that little flap just right here so I'm just kind of moving it just to get the inner corner so I'm just pressing that and again I'm going to just bring that up 
going to get into the bronzer I got. It really is a decent size. I'm just going to kind of pinch it. There is quite a bit of kick up. Not bad. But that's because I was like digging in. So I'm just going to kind of pinch it and just. I'm going to go around. Not the bottom. Rose blush brush. And just smile weirdly. A little creepy. Ooh, that is pigmented. But it also already has a glow to it, so I'm not going to put highlight. Going in with this new one, I have to take a thing. It is from Maybelline 180. Just putting it right in the middle. That is not strong, good, and it lasts a long hour. Okay. So, this is the final look. So, if you like my video, oh, I really do like this. This is a great shade for me. Love this. I've only, I only used, of, you know, so many colors, but the formula is amazing. Next video, I will stick with, like, the golds and the blues and stuff. I don't know. We'll see. But it's an amazing palette. I do have to try the other one that I had received. This, oh, my God. If it wears good, I'm in love because it covers my nose with no problem. It's a great shade. So, really, really like. Um, and it's easy to apply with both. And then, this is so pretty. It already has a glow to it, so I'm not really worried about putting on highlight. So, oh, you know what? I'll put mascara on in a little bit. And if you like my video, give me a thumbs up. If you want to join my little family, hit the subscribe button. Ring the notification bell just to get notified whenever I do upload a new video. Alright guys, see you guys in the next one.